just opened up your I just opened up your file and the first thing that I see is when I zoom on your sleeve is you can see that your seam lines are crisscrossing right here you can see that that first I thought that they were twisted but what it looks like to me is that this area see how these blue stitches they don't go to the back of the sleeve they go to the front of the sleeve in this front green stitches so you can see it right here they start from the front of the sleeve goes through her skin and go to the back of the cap so you simply instead of stitching the front to the front back to the back you stitch front to the back back to the front so at this point i have the edit sewing machine if this is so i'm just going to delete the sewing and now you can even so i deleted this sewing and you can clearly see that the front goes into the back so if this is confusing for you I would say so let me reverse this one uh, delete not reverse and you can see it disappeared so this is correct here you can see that this is going to the back to back and front to front so if this is confusing just uh, I always recommend that you click or hover so when I hover off this one you can see that this is the front then hover over the front I mean over the sleeve and you can see take a look in the 2d window when i hover over this one you can see it highlighting here when i hover over this part you can see that it highlights this area so it's this to this right and you can also see uh, you can also stitch it in the 3d window so it's not confusing so here to here okay so now let's see i hit simulate and the sleeve goes into place okay so always double check in the 2d and the 3d window and now it's uh i guess there might be something on the bottom too so i'm going to stop the simulation because it looks like there's something happening here too so i'm going to delete the sewing lines here the bottom sewing line too yeah this one was reversed too see the front went into the back so it's the same thing for the bottom part of the sleeve so let me delete this sewing line too and make sure that um, again you can come here I'm gonna separate the sleeve so to make sure I'm gonna click since you measured your line so I'm clicking on segment line so again you want to make sure I'm hovering over the 3D, take a look in the 2D window, you can see where that is, and then come to this part of the sleeve, <laughs> now it's kind of in her, and see, you know, which part of the sleeve is it highlighting. So let me just move it a little bit. It's uh, twisted here because it's, um, um, it was trying to simulate. So I'm gonna simulate it without that stitching and I'm going to stop it right there so that it's easier for me. I'm going to click on end segment sewing and okay, so this needs to go to that. So I'm looking, take a look in the 2D window as I'm hovering over these two, right? These are the correct ones and you can see which ones they are in the 2D window. So this one to this one. Okay, so it's this one to this one. Let's simulate. And it's closing perfectly. Okay, so now I'll, all I have to do is this to this. So let it drape for a second there. And again, end segment sewing tool. All we have left is this to this. And that's my back. Okay, simulate. And we all good. Okay, and that's your sleeve. It's pulling down, but um, it is stitched now correctly. Okay, so obviously now here you have to fix that, but everything else looks good.